Hi guys! I have here some of the Schminke watercolors and I'm going to mix these ones to get the super granulating watercolors. I'm filming this part now additionally after I finished doing everything because I noticed that I actually did not show you the colors at the beginning. So let's now just go, go through really fast through the colors which I've used and be, will be using in the following videos. There will be I think three videos because it was a long process of doing that but it was so fun to do it really I I'm happy that I did it this way and did not just buy the final product so the colors that I will be using are French ultramarine uh, they do have numbers but I think it is more in uh, more important now that I read the pigments because during my mixing of the colors I will be talking in pigments a lot of. So this is French Ultramarine PB29. I will uh, put a list in the description with the name and uh, color pigments. This is Manganese Violet. This one is PV16. Then we have... Cobalt to Keys, it is PG50. The next one is Mars Black. This one is PBK11. And then we have then we have the Mahogany Brown PBR33. This is Potter's Pink and this one is PR233. And this one is the only one that is not from uh, Schminke. It is Daily Roni, but I already had this one, so I did not want to buy a new one. And this one is the pigment PB36. Okay, so now let's start. Hi guys. I'm going to try and make the Schminke super granulating uh, watercolors. Uh, I have bought different single pigments. Uh, and I'm going to try and mix these ones. I've made a list. <laughs> Sorry. It is on this, what is this? A really old envelope. But I made a list of these pigments. And I'm going to try and mix them and just see. Uh, I'm not sure how much of the color I need. So I'm now just experimenting. Uh, I do not know how much of the blue or how much of the... What color is this one that I used? It's the mahogany brown. So I need these two ones to get that deep, uh, what was it? Deep sea violet, something like that. And it is, it is difficult, definitely. Because this this mah mahogany, it is so strong. I've put just a little bit there, and it's crazy. So this is uh, too much of the mahogany. So I do see the brown inside, but still. It is going to be difficult, definitely. Um, let's see another one. Ooh, which one? Um, so I, I have PB29 and I'm gonna take, let's see, PG50. So that's this one to get Glacier Blue. Now I'm just really taking just a little bit later. I'm going to mix these ones in the pans. But for now, let's see. So this one should be this one. So also here, I see much more of the, of the blue. Uh, so I think it's a good thing I bought a big blue one. Uh, 
This one looks nice. Put a little bit of water down. Hmm. Yeah, I do not see a lot of this one, so I think I need more. Okay, now I think I'm going in the right direction. This is maybe too much. So... Yeah, probably one-to-one -one with this one. So this one is a nine five one, but this is still a test, so I will have to um, make it better. And this one is nine six one, and this is probably I think one to one, and here a uh, two to one blue. Okay. The next one I'm going to mix is PB29 and PR233 and the PR233 is um, Potter's Pink. So let's take a little bit of the potter's pink out. Oh, that's a lot. So I need the blue. Need this one. It's a lot. And I will need this one. So this is actually Tundra pink, but I think it is too much of the blue. So let's try it out. So definitely too much of the blue here. I think this one is better. Okay, I like this one. So this one is actually more two to one, um, but not blue. It is the Potter's Pink. So two to one. Potter's. Okay. Um, next one, 
what else can I now try that I have the PR233 out. PR233. Ah, there are two different ones. This is interesting. What was this? Galaxy Violet. Galaxy Violet is made from the same pigments as the Tundra Pink. So here is the Tundra Pink PB29 PR233 and the Galaxy Violet PR233 PB29. So it's the same thing and I would actually say that the first, my first mix was Galaxy Violet. So for the Galaxy Violet I just need more of the blue but it is the same um, mix. Yeah, definitely. The same mix here. Just that in this case, I need more of the blue. Okay. So the next one I've mixed is the the Potter's Pink and the uh, Green Cobalt Turkeys. So these two should give me now glacier um, green yes and the number is six uh, nine six three i think um yeah it is working but i think maybe Maybe I would need more of the potter's pink inside, but still I do see the separation. You see it here? It looks nice. So I was a little bit afraid that this will not work, but it is actually working uh, pretty nice till now. So this is 963 Gletcher Green and this one here, uh, this one was I think 982 tundra violet and the other one was galaxy violet 972 made from the same pigments just different ratio and this one is more two to one but it's the cobalt turkeys okay Let's see, what else can we try? This one is difficult. Here I have actually three pigments inside. So this uh, deep sea blue, I have PG50. How does the deep sea blue look like? Hoppala, sorry. Deep sea blue. Well, it's okay. I do not see anything special about this one. So it is PG, this 50, the Cobalt Turquoise, the Ultramarine and Violet. And I think Mangan Violet. Where can I mix this one as well? The man Mangan Violet, uh, PV16. Let me just see. That's this one. I have it here with the glacier. That one as well. Interesting. Okay. 
so it's there and I forgot to make it here as well okay. yeah if if you want to know this for example this um, cobalt green color just to show you without the mix it looks like this and the uh, potter's pink they are drying really fast actually and this is potter's pink oh this is interesting so this is galaxy black and galaxy black is actually this one <laughs> let's say okay this is nice i already mixed it galaxy black i did not write the number so the number from this one i already forgot which one it was haha <laughs> uh this one here was deep sea violet and this was 951 and this one here is going to be galaxy black 975 and this one would actually be more more like one to one i would say no it's too much two to one yes two to one blue uh, i hope you understand what i'm saying uh, the, for example these deeps uh, what was it galaxy black it's made of the, of mars black and french ultramarine so when i was testing it um, i have used approximately two parts of the blue and one part of the mars black and here i had more blue so it was more like three to one okay so now i've tried that one uh galaxy blue 961 no i did not try galaxy blue it's the pg50 and pb29 so funny they are all made of similar pigments so for the galaxy blue i need pg50 which is this one And I need French Ultramarine. I think this is too much. This is too much. When I say too much, I mean too much of the blue in this case, I think maybe it could be the right one no 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 i need more of the turquoise and this is more the one the right one yeah this is more in that direction so in this case definitely more of the turquoise color so that will be the number 973 and I would say I would actually say 3 to 1 yeah probably from the turquoise cobalt yeah okay and let's see anything else so that would be this one i think i've tried this one this one i did not try and this complicated one it is really sunny outside and i'm getting some reflection that's why this paper looks a little bit yellow um it is yellow a bit but now it looks a lot Either way, I haven't tried anything with uh, mangan violet, so let's try this one. So PV16 and PG15. What? 
Oi, oi, okay, 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 okay. This this one was a little bit crazy. I need something. No. Well, let's take this. This was a lot of color that came out. Okay. So for that one, that two, that I'm mixing right now is the glacier. This one, turquoise glacier turquoise. Huh? Really? I need PE sixteen for that. That's interesting. I do not see the violet in this at all but okay i'm just gonna take a tiny bit because no this is too much oh this one is strong okay okay this is not no definitely not the color that i want Maybe this one. Well, it looks pretty similar to this one, which I made. I actually do not see any violet here. Hmm. But actually maybe only the violet is used for the granulation. I have to check it on the internet to see if I need more of the violet. Yeah, I, I need a bit more, just a tiny bit, but not too much. Okay, let's see now. Yeah, 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 okay. This is this is the right one. Oh, this is going to be difficult to mix. I <laughs> I should have bought also a big one of this one, so yeah. Um, not too much, just a little bit of this violet. Oh, this is going to be really difficult to mix, as I said. So this is, oh, I would actually say, no idea, five to one, like really a little bit of the violet. Okay, and one more to mix, and then I think I'm going to start filling the... Pants. So now that I have PV16, I need the black one and this is Galaxy Rosa. Really? PB... Mm, is this the black one? Am I right? Ah, no, 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 wait, I, I made a mistake. This is... I think Potter's Pink. No. Which one was that? Ah, PBR33 is actually mahogany brown. That's one, that one. Oh, I have to be careful because I have PBK11. I think I've mixed one wrong. No, I'm not sure. Well, this is not black, so it's uh, it's this mahogany one that I had at the beginning. So let's try that one. So I need a mahogany. And I think I need more of the mahogany. And of now the violet. And this one should be Galaxy Rosa.
let's see. Mm, I think I need more of the violet. I'm not sure, I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, I still more of the violet. This will be too much. Let's see now if I put some water there, what will happen? Hmm. I, yeah, this one is a difficult one. Because this mahogany is so strong. I've just taken tiny, tiny bit and you see I already have just brown. So that is definitely um, too strong. See, one more attempt. Well, actually it would be the best if I had all of these ones. <laughs> because they all fit together. But I think it's more like... Like this one. The Galaxy Rosa. Yeah, I think it's more that one. This one is just too... Now it's too... Too violet. It's not violet, but you know, it goes in that direction. Oh, is this really going to be difficult? Um, no, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Like, just... Ah, uh, no, I don't know. I've, I've mixed a little bit more. Maybe, maybe I really need... Four to one of the violet, and this color is nine seven one, and this one here. Was nine six two, I think. Okay, I'm gonna make a coffee break and then I will put them in the pans. Okay, I had enough of the break. Let's now start with the real things. So, I'm gonna use these pens that I bought. And they have like these magnets that arrived with them. And I have this box, so let's see. I think it should work. Let me just try one out. If I can, yeah, it fits really nice. Actually, I think I have enough of space. But let's see if this works. I hope this works as well. So I just have to put this one down. And, yep, it is. It's holding. So it will not fall out. This is nice. And I can just move them around however I want. This one has also a lower part, as you can see here. I love these kind of uh, boxes for my watercolors. And I'm not sure how much I need. I'm just going to put a couple of them. Okay, I think that will be enough. If not, I can always <laughs> take more. I bought 50 pieces. And... Yeah, I'm gonna try now and mix the colors inside. I will write here the color number, but not from the ones that I mixed. I will write the this number 
from the list here and after that I'm gonna swatch them. So guys, wish me luck, I hope it will work. So uh, I'm gonna start with, which one was it? 951. 951. It's a deep sea, deep sea violet. Um, nine five one. Nine five one. Just to have it there. Okay. So just to check one more time, for the 951 Deep Sea Violet, I need PB29, PB29, that's this one, and I need PBR33, so that's this one. Wow, let's see. So I said approximately 2 to 1, I'm not sure, maybe even less of this one. Yeah, I would actually say even less. So let's just put... Like... I do not want to use too much if I um, make it wrong. And then from Mahogany Brown... So that is a lot. I, I really do not want to use that much. I think. Let's try this much. Maybe it is too little, but we will see. It is probably too too little compared to the amount of the blue one, but and again I have to I have to try it to see if it's okay or not. It looks a little bit darker. Then, no, yeah, I think I need a little bit more of the brown inside. Yeah, a little bit more, not a lot. Or, yeah, I, I just a little bit. I want to put a little bit more. Let's try it like this, although it does look pretty similar, but let's take a little bit more. Not too much, this will be enough. Okay, let's see if it's better. I think it is a little bit better, although let's wait and see if there will be some brown inside. Right now, I think I need more brown. Yeah.
I see the brown there now. Let's see if this is better. I think I see the brown forming faster, but maybe it's just too much brown. Let's check the color on the internet. 951. Yep, that one was was the right one. This is too much. So the ratio is not 2 to 1, it is actually 3 to 1. And this color was the right one, so I have to put a little bit more of the blue. Because now I've made it just too dark. just a drop because this mahogany brown is a really strong color I hope this will be the last attempt. Yeah, I'm I'm more happy with this one. It's the the right blue. <clears throat> so this uh, ratio is three to one. So I'm gonna need a lot of these tooth pickers because okay. So I have the 951 Deep Sea Violet, it is done. And later I will do a nice swatch of all of the colors. But now I'm just gonna continue. Which one next? Let's do this one. This is 982 and the 98 is Tundra Rosa 982 so Tundra Pink mm. PB29 so I need this one and PR233 and that is the Potter's Pink and I need two to one, so I need more of the Potter's Pink. And PB29, which is this one. I think it is strong. We will see if it's really two to one. Let's do it like three to one and then later i can always add some color if i need it so you have to go on all of these edges because there is uh, the first color just sticks to the edges so you have to mix it okay let's try it now Oh, did I get the right amount? Let me see. Yeah, I think I did. 
So that was more like three to one and not two to one. More like three to one. Yeah, I like it. This one is it's nice, it's nice. Hooray for me. So have to write a number that is nine eight two. Next one, 972, I think this one was the same one, just the, the ratio the other way around. Let's see, 972 is the Galaxy Violet and the Galaxy Violet was PR233 with PB29. Yes, that's the same thing, just the other way around. A little bit more or maybe one to one mixture, not so much of the of the potter's pink so i will try or maybe two to one let's see two to one okay Yeah, something like that. And I think I can mix it with the same one because I've used the same pigments. So now I'm mixing the 972, which is Galaxy Violet. If I remember, I will try to put a um, time scale in the description so that you do not have to watch all of the whole video because it is going to be a long one. But if you want to try only some of the colors, so I will try to do that. Okay, let's see this one. Okay, I, I need a little bit more of the pigment. Not too much water there. Galaxy Violet. Let's see one more time. Galaxy Violet. Hmm, I'm not so sure. Have to check on the internet. I think it's okay. It it I checked it on the internet and I think this one looks uh, fine. So the Galaxy Violet is also finished. So this one was, I think two to one, two to one. Okay, next one, next one. Which one should I do? Should I finish with the blue ones? What was this one? nine seven five is galaxy black nine seven five is galaxy black so for this one i need again the french ultramarine and pbk so the mars black this one And yeah, I wrote two to one. I'm not so sure, but let's try it out.
which takes this one. And well, maybe, yeah, this is more like three to one. And I need a new one to mix it. this looks really black <laughs> actually they all look black and dark okay let's try this one Here. Well, I think I need more black. So actually, this two to one was um, was more or less right. I need more black here because it's just too blue. Okay. This black has some uh, strange smell. It's like mm, like gasoline. I'm not sure how to say it. Okay, let's try it now. Oh no, I forgot to wash it. Okay, for my taste, this is better now. I think this is the right one. Yeah, I think it's okay. So this is nine, seven, five. Nine, seven, five. Okay, so now I'm gonna uh, do this one. And then I think I will stop for now and upload the, the rest as the second video because now I definitely need a break. Nine, seven, three. Nine, seven, three, this is... Um, 
galaxy blue and for that one i need again the french ultramarine and these cobalt turquoise turquoise i'm not sure how to pronounce that three to one and which one is this nine six two is glacier turquoise well i'm actually they are pretty similar Glacier to keys. Let me see. Nine six two. Glacier PG fifty. Okay, it is a different. Um, there is a little bit of violet, and here is here is blue inside, but they look pretty similar to me. So three to one. I will try that one. I think this galaxy blue is fine so this is approximately the ratio yeah so these are the ones that i have till now i will read them to you in a second so i have the galaxy blue galaxy black galaxy violet uh, this one was, let me just, I have to find it. This was Tundra Pink. And this one, 951, was Deep Sea Violet. I still have, I think, five more to make. So that will be in the second video. Um, thank you for watching and see you next time for the other colors. Bye!